huge difference out there. Yeah, if you want to get out and do something active, you won't be just instantly sweating outside today. That is the difference. There is much, much less moisture in the atmosphere. You will feel it when you step outside. And the good news is it's going to stay low throughout the day. So today is one of those perfect days where it's comfy and crisp in the morning, a beautiful evening as well. Nice and warm in the afternoon, warm enough to get out on the beach. Here's Summers Point looking at the bay here with that blue sky and these wispy clouds right now around the area. We are in the 60s. It feels amazing. It's been a while since we've been there. 69 degrees in Philadelphia right now, 63 in Trenton, 65 degrees in Redding and 67 this morning in Millville. So we're looking at a beautiful Friday, 86 degrees, low humidity. Winds out of the northwest, they're light, 5 to 10 miles per hour, beautiful breeze today. Just doesn't get much better for a summer Friday than this. Tonight, 68, partly cloudy and comfy. Now, if you're stuck at work all day and you kind of wish you would could flip today and tomorrow, I feel you on that one. It is going to be a little cloudier tomorrow. It's not a bad day and it's not all that hot, but while we'll see some sun in the morning, it does cloud up a bit in the afternoon and don't be shocked if a stray shower rolls through and maybe moves you indoors just for a brief time. It does not look like a washout. The problem is we've got a new disturbance that's firing up to the south. But you can see this moisture right here over parts of Mississippi and Alabama this morning. That's going to be lifting northward and while most of the rain with this will stay south, I want you to notice the increase in cloud cover after a beautiful day today. Nothing but sun and a light breeze tonight. We start to see just a few more high clouds drift in overnight. We'll start tomorrow partly sunny. Now the morning looks pretty nice. A few more clouds. Yes, but we'll see a decent amount of sunshine here. 930 in the morning. Then as we get into the afternoon, it kind of clouds over a bit and right here about between about three and five o'clock. I think there will be a few spotty showers. I don't think we have much to worry about as far as heavy thunderstorms. It's not really warm enough or humid enough to get anything like that, but could be a Rumble here or there, but it's not a washout, just a few sprinkles, and then we'll dry it out again at night, all except for the shore. Now, this line of rain will likely come through the shore points overnight tomorrow night into Sunday morning. So, this is 1 a.m. Sunday and continuing through about 3, 4 a.m., but very quickly by the time you wake up, really, we're back to sunshine on Sunday, and it looks like a really nice day, just slightly more humid. So, if you're heading away for the weekend, gorgeous Friday. If you can get down early, maybe leave now, get a jump on that traffic. A fantastic shore Friday. Beautiful in the Poconos as well. Clouding up tomorrow down the shore. Better chance for a shower in the Poconos in the afternoon. And then Sunday looks like a great beach day, a great lake day, a great day to get outside. We're seasonable. We're looking at mid to upper 80s through the weekend. Again, just a few more clouds tomorrow afternoon. Monday looks pretty nice as well. And then shower and storm chances return right into the middle of next week.